What about Ninian Park? Because obviously the new stadium's there now and, and it's all singing, mm. all dancing, training ground, etc. Um, mm. But Ninian Park will obviously have, uh, have great memories for you, uh, like it has for me, for certain for certain things. Yeah. But what about your memories of Ninian? Uh, uh, it's funny because I remember mm. that you got the, the concave pitch uh, and sometimes when you weren't starting, you'll be on the bench yeah. and you couldn't see you couldn't see the ball, could you, over no. the far side because no. it once went down the hip. Yeah. But uh, yeah, you know, uh, really great fans. Um, but I think probably because they are so passionate and obviously it's, it's a Welsh club uh, playing in the English league, uh, I think, you know... I remember when we beat Leeds in the FA Cup, yeah, and, uh, and 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 sadly, it became like a, a kind of an anti Walsh thing. Uh, but the fans were amazing, and that's, yeah. that's such a massive highlight. Uh, and unfortunately, we should have got a lot more credit uh, for that result. Yeah, totally agree. Uh, so totally it, agree, it, yeah. it just turned a little bit, and you know, it was overshadowed, time, overshadowed, wasn't it? overshadowed by probably the, the the hostile part of it and the atmosphere yeah, and yeah, instead of the result yeah. and, and the main focus being on the. You know, I mean, yeah. Leeds, Leeds at the time were Champions League. Yeah, they were top of the league, weren't they? Yeah, yeah they were they were a really good side. So, side, so that yeah. was great. So that was yeah. great. Yeah, the, the fans are great. But I think, again, we're lucky because I think if 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 you give fans success, they respond. Yeah, got So, it. and again, I've been a fortunate in yeah. the past that, you, you, you know, sites happened whereby you, you've clicked as a team, as a, as a mm. squad, and you do well, and the fans respond to that. Yeah. Um, well, well, you had you had obviously uh, two promotions, obviously at the football club. You know what I mean in a in a short space of time, running from Ninian Park, and you know what I mean. Like you just yeah. there, the, the fans are passionate. You know what I mean. Like, like my my first experience was was the following Saturday after my debut. We played Blackpool at home, and I, it reminded me a little bit of Ayrson Park, where everyone's on top of you. You know what I mean. That the fans yeah. are really you, like you've just said that. As long as you give what they want, they'll give exactly yeah. like what you need. And uh, yeah. I, I I didn't ever play at Ninian against Cardiff but I can imagine it was a hostile place to play as an opponent you know what I mean because mm. you know they didn't give you any change everything was quite hostile yeah. about, uh, about the songs and the chanting but yeah. as, a, as a player they give you exactly what you needed to get you through a game and mm. you know what I mean I think I don't know obviously I've watched games at the new at the new stadium and I don't get that yeah. kind, I don't get that kind of atmosphere now in, in brand new stadiums because yeah. fans are yeah. spotted around instead of being in, in one they area are. you know yeah, I mean, I think the nature of football has changed now in terms yeah, of absolutely. in terms of fans. Uh, I suppose in a good way because you look at club grounds nowadays. There's there, there's um, lots of women, there's lots of children, yeah. Yeah, yeah. and they're all kind of intimate. It's become more kind of family orientated, yeah. which is a good thing, I suppose. Well, you need the, future, the next you need the next generation as well, though, because yeah. you know, like you just said, your, your boys now twenty and seventeen that 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 football clubs need those those kind of boys yeah. coming through to buy the next season tickets because they have kids. You know what I mean? The next yeah. generations are gonna are going to see, especially through this kind of uh, yeah. t- t- tough times mm-hmm. that football clubs need supporters, they need money, they, yeah. need, they need the next generation of fans to push them on to the next level because yeah. without, without supporters, football's nothing. And I'm, yeah. I'm, not, I'm, not a big, I'm not a big fan and, and an advocate of, of the football being played behind closed doors because for me, I, right. I, don't, I don't know about you, that I used to hate playing reserve games because reserve yeah. games for me, no, no atmosphere. Yeah. I had it generally yeah. myself, hated yeah. it. Because yeah. I used to, I used to love scoring a goal and and, mm. and celebrate with players, teammates, friends, yeah. but also supporters as well. And and yeah. without that, I don't, I don't know how do you, how do you generate that kind yeah. of excitement yourself to be a player? You know, so yeah. it's, it's such a it's, it's, such very, a it's very different. What do you think we should do, or the league should do, in terms of these these last nine games in the football league? Um, yeah, I would have liked UEFA and FIFA to come up and and and, and do everything the same, so the whole country yeah. is yeah. Yeah. Following, following suit, but. Obviously, that's not been that's not been possible. Everyone's doing their own thing. I'd, I'd like it to finish because I think everyone deserves to to, to finish what they've started. You know, what I mean, Liverpool deserve the yeah. league. Leeds yeah. deserve the championship and deserve being yeah. in the Premier League. But I can't yeah. see. I don't see the point in rushing it. You know what I mean? For me, mm. wait wait until it's safe, hundred percent safe, yeah. and then start it. Yeah. If that's September, August, finish the season. If that finishes at Christmas, then and then we have some kind of shortened tournament stroke. Yeah, just cup competitions next year, and yeah. you know, I mean, we, 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 it's it's impossible now for me to have two full seasons finished. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. You know, no, I okay. agree. I mean, we have to finish. I mean, I think you know, uh, Liverpool. You know, they have yeah. to win this league, first league in two yeah. nine years. Yeah. Uh, unfortunately for me, you are where you are. So yeah. right now, there's a bottom three, and yeah. there's a bottom three. You're there for a reason. Too so right you are. Yeah, you, you can't. You know, Too right you are. But then, but then, yeah. if, you, if you're going to vote, Leo, you know what I mean. That Aston Villa are going to vote to. Um, yeah. To cancel yeah. because they don't want yeah. to go down, and yeah, you know, what I mean, for the same. And middles yeah. middle, 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 middle were going to vote to avoid the season so they don't get relegated. Where Luton yeah. are going to, you know, what I mean, it's just so unfair yeah. on, on the sides who 
you know what I mean? Because you, there's the run about points per game as well, which yes, it's probably the fairest way to do it. But you could you could have nine games, which are easy mm. games or hard games. Yeah, how's that work yeah. out? Because you could play the top ten yeah. or the top. It just doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't exactly. make sense to me. But, yeah, it's, um, um, but yeah, but uh, right, well, uh, right. What about what, what's oh. the what's the, what's your best moment in a in a Cardiff shirt? Then you know what I mean? Because I, I, I hear I, not... I hear a lot about about one moment, which I'm yeah, going to mention. Yeah, I mean that was a combination. But um, before that, I think you look at games and look at promotions, and you think, well, for me, um, the April Bank Holiday that's the start of the running. Yeah. So if you're up there at that point, then you know yeah. that's the running. But there's always a game before that. Yeah. That gives you the belief. Yeah, yeah. And uh, uh, we played, uh, my first year, we played Leighton Orient at home. Uh, I think it was either 1 0 down or, or 2 1 down, but we came back and, and won by a goal. And Kurt, Nor- uh, Kurt Nogan scored the yeah, winner. Yeah, okay, yeah. And, and it, it, was that, it was that game that kind of gave you belief moving forward. Yeah. And that was, you know, that, that, that was the start of it. Obviously, with, um, with the, the York game. Yeah. Where you know free fees are ridiculous uh, yeah. result really, and then you go from kind of think well actually we've kind of blown it by not winning, yeah. but then you realise that obviously the, the results around you have gone have gone the uh, have gone your way. But Booth so, and Crescent, Booth and Crescent as well though that's one of them nice places you go and play. You know what I yeah. mean? It's, it's, uh, it's yeah. a very very nice place to play yeah. football. It's not very hostile. Yeah. You know what I mean? I'm guessing there was loads of Cardiff fans there to yeah. to potentially yeah. see Cardiff through the. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's, it's it's a day that will live long in my memory. Uh, yeah. uh, you know, obviously the score three goals as well it was lovely. The thing is, mate, no one can no one can take those moments away from you, though, can they? No, no. Uh, and obviously, we're going to come on to this a bit later about kind of uh, you know football and the afterlife. And I think you know whatever you do, any player, no matter how well you've done or or how short your career was, what you've done is yours. You yeah. look back and they're your memories. Yeah, and totally no one's been taken away. Yeah, you know? totally agree. Totally agree. Yeah. Um, obviously, uh, how about yourself? Mine, obviously, mine. You, I don't think you can look past uh, obviously the playoff final. You know what I mean? There's yeah. there's other individual games. You know what I mean? The the Oldham game, which obviously me and you yeah. played up front together, was you know what I mean? I'm going to talk yeah. about. I'm going to talk about later on uh, a little bit. But the playoff final. You know what I mean? I was I was touch and yeah. go to to be to obviously be fit for that because I remember you came to my. You came to my house uh, after I've had my hernia operation to, yeah. to see how I was. Yeah, and I, I, remember, was yeah. I was I was struggling. You know what I mean? I I I I'd, I'd risked the operation to, to 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 try and be fit, but you know what I mean? There was just yeah. something in my head which was telling me that I'd left it too long, or I wasn't hundred percent, or I knew I wasn't hundred yeah. percent on the morning of the game. Yeah. So um, yeah. to be able to be sub was a was a bonus. You know what I mean? Obviously, there was yeah. obviously disappointing people that they weren't involved. Obviously, like like yourself and things. But yeah. you know what yeah. I mean? To be able to to play a part and. You know what I mean? To yeah. play a huge part at the end of the game was 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 massive. To score that yeah. goal was was the best yeah. feeling ever. But then to be able to share it after with yeah, you know what I mean? with yourself yeah. and with Gav Gordon, yeah. the first two people who came up to yeah. me, you know what I mean? Was yeah. just probably the better feeling than yeah. it was the goal. You know, yeah. so I mean, you're not smiling, but you know, you said a goal, but it was just like a, a regular goal. Was it? It was a great goal. As no, well. well, you know, it was. Yeah, it was. And every time yeah. I watch it, it, it fills me full of like just just pride yeah. and goosebumps because it was a, you know, I mean, it, yeah. probably the probably the, the the quality of the goal was probably. Overrided the, the the importance of it because yeah. you know what I mean. Everybody everybody loves yeah. to score any kind of goal, but you yeah. know what I mean. You you, you know what I mean. The yeah, goal, such, you know, it was such a it was a, just yeah. an excellent goal, and you know what I mean. Yeah. And, and we we all live yeah. for moments like that because nobody yeah. can ever Amazing. take those kind of goals Amazing. away, you know. So, yeah, and what a day as well. I mean, um, yeah. Years later, I went to Wembley twice uh, yeah. to, to play uh, towards the latter part of my career. But you know, t- when you go to Cardiff and you're travelling on the coach. And you, you, it's all high street, isn't it? It's all high street, yeah. and you see fans on both sides, and they're waving to you, and it's, it's such a, a, a lovely experience. Yeah. Uh, Wembley's different because it's all industrial. Yeah. So you kind of go in, you go out, you go around, and you yeah. see no one at all, no. and you come up in the stadium. So that actually, cool. that journey to the Millennium was just—it was such a such a great yeah, day. Yeah, I just, I just, I just think from start to finish, you know, what I mean, from waking up to breakfast to going for a walk to, uh, you know, what I mean, around the golf course, and you know, what I mean, it was, it was, you could just. You could write a story about it because it just it was yeah. just so so surreal and and the moment and you know what I mean. But then you spoke about it earlier about you know what I mean. You probably don't realise the importance of it or you know what I mean yeah. or the other, or the other implications of it because yeah. obviously it had, an, it, had an, it had a huge impact on on other people's careers because yeah. they obviously left Cardiff because the car then the, the club were going to another level. They obviously went and yeah. bought Alan Lee. Um, yeah, Rich, Richard Langley, yeah. etc. So you know what I mean. That sometimes yeah. your, your goal can have a negative effect on your own career, but yeah, you don't yeah, want to, you, you don't yeah. want to take it away. But you look at yourself, and then you look where Cardiff are now. That's in part 
due to, to well, your said, team, due yeah, to was, my team. So this yeah, is a yeah, progression, I've said, isn't I've it? I've said this all the way that every time that I've saw, you know, I was I was at this I was at the stadium the day the card got promoted the the last time, you know what I mean, under under Neil Warnock and you know what I mean, just just sat there with just huge, huge pride to think that that we'd all played a huge part in that moment. Yeah, you know what I mean? We hadn't yeah. done it on the pitch, but you know, I mean, where that where the club is now with a new stadium and new yeah. training ground and, and the yeah. players they've got now. If, yeah. if we hadn't have got promoted and you hadn't have got promoted at York yeah. and we hadn't have done it in the Millennium Stadium, the football yeah. club might be in turmoil because yeah. the players would have yeah. dis- dispatched their yeah. right and centre. You're absolutely been, right. Yeah, such, you're such absolutely a, right. Such a different time, you know. Because what what you did, what I did, so uh, what, uh, what happens is, is that when we get a promotion, other players, better players who wouldn't have come, they can yeah. now come. Yeah, yeah. And that's how that's how our club moves forward. So yeah, though yeah. you know, you know, that's that year when I, when I when I when I, when I played, uh, replaced by, uh, you know, Forney, which is and and that's again. So ultimately, had we not gone up, he wouldn't have come. Yeah. And it's again, it's, it's, it's the progression, isn't it? So you're you're part of the club's history, which is great. Yeah, and I know yeah. we can take that away because you know, I mean, like when people say about Cardiff fans are very passionate, they never forget. You know, what I mean, sometimes everybody's or n- n- people always forget, but they don't forget. You know what I mean? Yeah. That that somebody was on about. I think it was it was it was so many years to the day of your hat trick, not so long a couple yeah. of years ago. You know right. what I mean? And, and then the Millennium Stadium always comes up, and and people just don't let you forget. It's just yeah. it, it, is, it is amazing because it's yeah. it's what we're on about 17, 18, 19 years ago for for both of us. Yeah. So it's, it's a long, long yeah. time, and people just people don't forget. You know? Yeah. 